I am the internet and I like it when KSSU is on me. All right, Matt and Tech Show, live on KSSU.com. I'm Tex. That's Tex, and I'm Matt. Oh, man, what a day. Yeah. It's, it's November 1st. First, man, October went by really quickly. Yes, thank goodness. Halloween's over. You're not a big fan of Halloween? No, not at all. Okay. He's a... Too many little kids. Real big hater there, Tex. Yep, that's um, me. Um, all right. Next Tuesday, the 8th. Oh, you just could jump right to it. Oh, well. I didn't even. Of course I am. Didn't it's even throw all the it's extra stuff. This is the Matt and Tech Show, KSU.com. Like us on Facebook. We have 98 likes. Uh, two more till uh, 100. People can add. People, some people can't. I don't know. Okay, you're two right. Two more until 100. And um, I'll do something fancy for the, on the show. Don't know what it is yet. Probably, probably won't figure that out until we get 100. Yeah, but I probably shouldn't say that. Anywho. <laughs> <laughs> so what were you really interrupting me with? Oh, well, next week. Next Tuesday. Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 comes out. I'm trying to convince Matt to uh, not have a show, but we'll see. Oh, yeah, all right. Because Tex likes every every year when the new Call of Duty games comes out. Cod Fever comes um, around. He gets sick and does not go to school. Cod Fever. Yay. You. Okay, that, that makes no sense at all, but I, I, I typically skip the next day. Whatever it is, and just yeah, he usually spend just all day playing games. Yeah, just like... It's uh, a new Call of Duty, you gotta. You don't gotta. You definitely gotta. I'm gonna be here at school, doing the radio show. I would like for you to be here. I don't know, I'll see if I can make it. <laughs> you will make it. <laughs> um, maybe, I'll, uh, maybe I'll play in the, uh, the Union. We got a, l- a little game room in the Union here. Maybe they'll have it and I'll play just over there. Just bring your own TV. They have Wi-Fi here. Like, I'm not going to lug a whole big TV on. If you're a it. fan, Tex. Turn it up a bit. I think we're very quiet. Oh, my God. I'll hey. kill you. In the okay. Well, if they can't hear us, this is the whole point of the show. Am I right? Thank no. you. Call us in and tell us I'm right. The phone number is 278-366. Matt, what's the last number? It's 3666. It's 916 278 Some people live, like, I have a, someone on the Facebook page lives in Utah. Tyler, my brother, is in London. So he'd have to go to the area code and put a one first. Um, uh, he's in London. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> Come on! Every time you hear that, you gotta say say something. Hello, governor. Why? Because you do. You what about when I say uh, Paris? What do you think of? <laughs> <laughs> just that, that, that deep throat laugh, or cigarettes, and or or your experience with the with the prostitute. Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? Matt, stop bumping stuff. What was that noise? You're bumping things over there. It was on there too. See it? Yeah, I saw that's the offensive. Spike in Anywho, we've got a wonderful show for you today. We do have a pretty good show today. Right, um, Matt uh, put on our Facebook page a little a music video. Is it a music video or is it just? Uh, it's a it? kind of a. They call them. Uh, I don't know what they call them, but it's like in, they're like in the studio and they recorded them playing a song. So it's, it's kind of a live experience, but it's the video for that song. But not the music video, if they're ever going to have it. It's not an official music video, it's just them playing it. It's, uh, um, what was what's the name of the band? 16 I Years by Phantogram. Phantogram is the band. Their new EP years. came out today called Nightlife. I love it. I love Phantogram. We'll be playing um, that song for you. We're playing that song. And, and check out the link. Some other new music and some other, um, some other songs of course I dropped my pen uh, take that other one up down there too that's not my pen there you go I just made you do that we'll go to the first song um, I'm just gonna play it uh, it has no real importance just gonna play the song cause I like it alright Ode to LRC by a band of horses um, enjoy and we're back we're look back. at all that Thanks. check that out yeah check that out alright we're spiking thanks iTunes for uh, saying the song had about a minute left to go yeah but thanks again Matt for you know uh, scoping out the song before I could have listened prior to make sure uh, you should have listened prior you should have known I was busy yesterday yeah, we were at that? the mall get that reference I wasn't listening you should have known Oh, reference to the last time you screwed last up time I screwed up, up. <laughs> <laughs> yep whatever it happens right. so it's it live does, not live. to me <laughs> what? Huh? <laughs> all right. All Back right. on the Matt and Tech Show. KSSU.com. KSSU.com. <laughs> all right. You were saying uh, yesterday was Halloween, and uh, so I don't like Halloween. I figured, hey, let's do something not Halloween-y. Right. I had a film project. Exactly. <coughs> I have a film project due Thursday, and I needed the help of Tex and uh, executive producer Trevor. Mm-hmm. Tex, of course, was in his boring physics lab until about 6 so we didn't get to my that house the until the sunset. So I could not film outside because you're a jerk. 
And yet we ended up going to the mall and doing something even better. What? what was Wasn't that? Didn't you say that was your dad suggesting to go to the mall and? Uh, it was my dad's a couple of shots that I used. Um, no, y- you would have thought, because Matt were dressing in all black, and wearing his black Google shirt, you would have <laughs> thought that he worked for Google. So if anybody said anything, we would have just said, "Hey, you want to be a want to be a picture for Google or something like that?" Speaking of Google, they wouldn't have said nothing. Monday or yesterday, I had a speech due in my comms class, and my speech was all about how Google has changed the world. I can go ahead and recite it for you guys if I, if you want. Please don't. All right. All right. We'll go to the next song. This song is called Bearing Luck. Bearing Luck. Burying. Like burying the dead. Something like that. Right. But luck. Burying. Yeah. Burying luck. luck. Right. Not, band not like is strawberry. Band luck. is called Minus the Bear. Minus the Bear. Minus the Bear. Oh, minus. Uh, they'll be at the Ace of Spades. Ace of Spades. Which is a... a I don't know where I've heard that from. I heard that from somewhere. So it's a song, but this is a, a <laughs> venue down uh, downtown Sacramento. They'll be playing next um, Monday, the seventh. And I really want to go, but I have to work. So um, that's a no go. That's a no go. I really do want to go. There's also never mind. We'll talk about that later. Um, enjoy the song called "Burying the Luck." Burying the luck. Strawberries. Hey, you did that well, Tex. Oh, that's why I can't hear because my my your headphones aren't plugged in. Sorry, I was checking. Good countdown, by the way. Checking the sound. You're welcome. Three, two, one, and we're live. All right, we're back. <laughs> this is the <laughs> Matt and Tex on. show. I'm Tex. I'm Matt. All right. Yeah, just a reminder that was minus the bear. Um, they'll be playing at Ace of Spades downtown in Sacramento, of course, uh, on the seventh. So next Monday, feel free to go and um, just go for me. Let me know how it is. All right. What time is that? Google it. <laughs> Wait, you said you wanted to go to that, right? I wanted to go to it, but I'm going to be working. You're going to go to the midnight release of uh, Modern Warfare 3 with us, aren't you? When is that? The Matt! What is that? I don't like that at all. I tell you, stop bumping And there stuff. it is again. It's uh, recording, too. The, the midnight release is on... Yeah, Matt, it, it's, it's this table. Don't touch the table. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thanks. I figured that Sorry, out. Sorry, go. The midnight release is on... We go... Don't touch the table. <laughs> the midnight release is on Monday. It's the eighth. Oh, it's on the so Monday. We'd have to go Monday Damn. to be there at midnight Tuesday. That's and where last where you last buy it? time we Where'd went. You buy it? Uh, the GameStop in front of uh, Panda. My like Panda next to Panda. Ugh, I'm glad we could just ride our bikes there or something. Yeah, they uh they did uh they do it they did a deal last time. They just came out and said, hey, dollar for. Couple things, you know, made a cheap deal. Still made money. All the stuff that the, they've got to throw away at the end of the day, anyways. Might as well give it out to the people sitting there. Were they, what? Like what? I don't remember. I d- I'm not a fan of Panda. What did they? No. Hot oh, stickers. Panda was doing that. Yeah, I used Panda to was GameStop doing was handing things out for a dollar. I, I didn't wish. know what you were saying. No, Panda was um, the, yeah, giving out food for a dollar. There was almost a fight last year. Or two years ago, sorry. Because last year. I got here first, man. Give me the Panda. No, it was, it was over a dog. This guy's like... Someone was trying to eat the dog? No. What what happened was... Cause we went at 4 o'clock. Trevor said, Hey, let's go at 4. I'm like, I wanted to go at 10. Two hours early. But we went there. And there was already a guy waiting. And uh, he had his dog in his uh, in his SUV in the parking lot. He could see it. Window completely open. It was fine. It was dying. No. It, well, maybe. But anywho. The guy went up and went, went up to pet it. And, and he's like, Dude, don't... <laughs> you know, I don't, I don't have a problem with you petting my dog, but you're not supposed to approach a, a strange dog. I, it was like a, a pit bull or something like that. You're not supposed to approach a strange dog. And the guy's like, oh, I'll do whatever I want. Lifts up his shirt. He's got tattoos. And he's like, oh, big whoop, you got tattoos. Oh. He literally lifted his shirt. Yeah, he lifted show off his, his yeah. kitten tattoos. His, tat- his tattoos. I don't remember what they were. You did take a picture? Uh, no. <laughs> but um, you would have. Anywho, <laughs> with your <laughs> fancy camera. Fancy camera. Turn it in for your uh, film class. Anywho. Yeah, there was wow. almost a fight, so they would have canceled the whole thing. And I was upset, because when we got in there, when when we finally got our games, because we were second, it was uh, uh, Trevor, executive producer, and our friend Nick. What are you getting at? I'm just explaining how it went down and how it might go down this year. Oh, okay. Uh, so I was zoning out. So, yeah, we got there eight hours early, and I got home. And ten minutes later, our other friends, who were at the back of the line, got on, so there was no point to go early. Anywho, so that's what it's going to be like. Are you going? So we should go two hours earlier, not mm, not eight. Yeah, something like that. Uh, 
It's a Monday? Yes, it's a Monday. And our show is the next day. Our show is the next day. Could be canceled. Could be canceled. I'll think about it. All right. Um, well, yeah. Next song, 16 Years by Fantagram. Fantagram um, is one of my favorite bands, um, new bands. Not really new, but um, their EP came out today. EP. EP. Environmental Protection. <laughs> no. And it's like early promo, isn't it? Something um, like that? No. Um, I don't know. Up. Actually, yeah, Wikipedia. Anyways, this new EP, call is, it, EP is called Nightlife. And Extended today, Play. I just bought it, and I'll be playing the song called 16 Years. Like I said, the video is on our Facebook page. Um, feel free to enjoy and watch. She is hot. Um, so incentive for for anyone out there to watch this video and like our Facebook page. We have 98 likes. Uh, here's 16 Years by Fanagram. Three, two, one, and we are back. You're still worse. You gotta, you gotta listen to what I'm saying, and uh, then count down. Because or not. you don't count down. Maybe I people like down. to count down. Maybe you could just keep doing that. All right, um, Matt. Just during the commercial break was uh, securing more music for our show. What? I was. What are you talking about? Securing. What was I doing? All right. Anywho, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you're saying, Tex. Um, I have. Uh, I went to. Uh, by the way, that was what, this. Matt, stop. you're touching I'm it. I'm not. M- my hands I gotta are talk up to in the Susie. air. All right. Um, that was Fanagram. They'll be at um, at Sacramento sometime. I they'll be it. at the East of Speed. No, where are they at tonight? I don't know, Matt. You're the one who knows concerts. Their concerts tonight at the Ace of Spades. The Ace of Spades. Sorry, Harlow's. They're at Harlow's. Harlow's. 21 and up, so you have to be older than 21. So not you. I couldn't go if I wanted to, but I really do want to. Um, okay. So I was hoping to get a fake ID. But I couldn't. All right. Um, yeah. So on to your story, text. So um, everybody's uh, like getting iPhones and iPhones. Android phones, smartphones and things. And me and Matt are pretty tech savvy people. So me I more, figured that I so would. Uh, me. Huh? More so me. I'm yeah, that's right. I'm more tech savvy than you. I didn't want to say anything, but God, you brought I it up. Did. And so I have a, a list of uh, from a website that says the uh, the top apps to get from uh, uh, from the month of October. And I'll that was last month. That was last month. Yes. Thanks. S- yep. For staring at me right there. Throw some and of those I'll just apps um, I'll give you the iPhone ones, and then uh, I'll give you also the Android ones, and then we'll talk about them a little bit. First, uh, first one's iPhone one. It's called My Secret Folder. Now, Ooh, gross. Well, yeah, it's, it's pretty much that. It, it, it's supposed to look like an app that'll hold um, um other apps, you know, like a folder on your yeah, a, f- your a folder. System. But but really, when you click on it, it'll pop up, and it'll ask for a password, and you can Ooh, password. Yes, password protected. So you could put uh, videos, uh, pictures, things in there, things that you don't want people to see. Like, oh my gosh! Um, so uh, that was secret. that was one of the top apps of October. Well, it, it didn't say top apps. This is apps to have, like the new ones that'll make okay. your life much better. Okay. So I'll go to the first Android one now. I'll just alternate between uh, Android and iPhone. Uh, it's called G Gianni, I think. Spell it. G E A N N I E. Okay, I couldn't. No, nope. Jan. Yeah, it, it's it's um, it's Android's answer to Siri. It, it's it's basically oh. the Siri uh, you <coughs> speak into. I already it. have one of those apps. It's called uh, Iris, which is Siri backwards. I were yeah, I heard about that one too. And then this is is just, that one better? This is just another. Because Iris um, is not good. It's not that good. Well, it'll answer you sometimes. Like my uh, manager Verizon, um, he was like in the kiosk. He gave it a joke like, "How did, why did the ch- chicken cross the road?" She's like, "I don't know why." Um, and then he answered. He's like, "Oh, that's a ro- that's a funny joke. Tell another." Um, but you have to. If you, I asked it like, "How many hours a day does a lion sleep?" And it said, "Too many." Um, so it well, no, it, really it's it's answer. it's doing it's doing the uh, the the smart aleck answers that uh, Siri does that too. Sometimes. Yeah, but Siri, I did it on. We had the iPhone and oh yeah, uh, you, you get to play with both. Of them. Um, and um, Siri actually gave answers. Uh, I, see, I see. Not just smart aleck remarks. I see. Anyways, what this one? What's so special about this one? Uh, well, yeah, I, like I said, it's just their answer to it. It, m- it might be better than Iris. Uh, I don't know. We'll uh, we'll see. I'll probably download it and see what it is. I'll give you a review. Mm-kay. Never. Okay, we'll see. Uh, so some of these apps cost. Some of them are free. Oh. I mean. Well, I have an app that actually by app bypasses any of those. Oh, okay. Things. Yeah, stealing. All right. The, <laughs> the next one for uh, is iPhone. It's a, it's a game called Whale Trail. <coughs> whale. Whale Trail. Like whale wars. L- like a whale. Japanese whale. Like a whale. 
Pretty sure it's what a whale sounds like. It's a uh, description here. Is, you play a flying whale that dodges storm clouds and collects bubbles. <laughs> that sounds enjoyable. It sounds awesome. It, it's it's a, a cute little addictive game, kind of like Angry Birds or Tiny Wings was. I don't know. Interesting. It's I'm about. sorry. I was. You collect bubbles. You collect bubbles. What's what's the movement? Is it like a yeah? You you move up and down across and down. the screen trying to avoid mean storm clouds. I don't know. Could Why be are there storm clouds for whales? Why is that? Is that the uh, number one? I don't know. It's like a maybe ra- giant squid would be a lot better. Yeah, perhaps number one predator. Um, whales. Another one for a- Android here is called the Swipe Pad. Uh, Swipe Pad's a better app. Uh, switching uh, switching apps between your Android phone. Now, see, that's that's why I was a little what? confused. I'm not really sure what you're saying. It, it's a, it, right here. It says Swipe App is, really? a, is a better app switcher for your Android phone. Instead of holding down the home buttons to launch your recent apps, Swipe Pad uses hotspot corners and edges you're of your phone much. screen to trigger. Okay, you're right. Well, see, that that's why I don't understand. Well, how is it you select apps oh, better? Um, it's a it's like a multitask kind of thing because you have. Apps oh. that you you so have different windows and tabs kind of on. So apps. you'll you'll swipe um, from any of the corners, I guess, and it'll. I, people can't hear me. Yeah, you should be on your mic. And uh, um, you swipe any of the corners, and I guess it'll pull up the most recent apps instead of pushing, holding down the home button, which you can do already on Android phones. Okay, yeah. See, that's why you're here. You have an Android. I have an iPhone. So I'm also talented at both. Hmm? So you don't have to be here at all. Oh, okay. Oh. Next one is a kind of a dumb one for iPhone. It's called the Swack It. It's a, it's a weather app. That sounds gross. But instead, uh, instead of uh, telling you the weather, like, hey, it's gonna be sunny today, it, it shows you a person wearing, like, it, it was, yeah, wearing clothes. Like, if it was gonna be cold, just they're wearing a lot of jackets. Like an Eskimo. Yeah, probably. Or if you're going to. Um, oh, that's dumb. I could see a picture. Is that actual? Yeah, it, it's just like it's just one of those uh, like bath. You know those bathroom figures they put men and women. You see the little. The just the basic guy outline or, yeah. of a man mm-hmm. or woman. And case. it's just wearing jackets and or things depending on the weather. That is a dumb one. Good good uh yeah. Yeah. Uh, these Anyone are these else? are the things yeah, that are hot, I suppose. Yes, of course I got some more. Um <coughs> Win app. It's a it's a music app for the uh for the Win Android, app. it's called WinApp. That's been around for a while. Yeah, it says it says it's been available for some time, but uh, maybe it's just recently picked up in popularity. And stuff. W- w- see, th- that that's one of the. Tell f- me what it is. I don't know. It says you know, is it radio playing music now. WinApp for Android is updated to wirelessly sync their music and videos with the Mac. Right. So that's what it's meant for. I don't know if it's an actual music player. There's also an MP3 of the day and premium version with more features, so you can pay yeah. for more for. You know, I use Google Music. Google has music. Google Music is a, a app that syncs any of your files on your computer, puts them in their cloud, not their cloud, Google server, mm-hmm. um, and you can stream them wherever you are. Um, instead of wasting all, sp- all the space on your phone, you simply stream it. Uh, and if you get out of a zone where you can't stream, uh, it remembers the last like 50 or so songs you played, um, so you can play those back whenever you like. Is that all the apps you have? No. Is that your? Do you have more? Yeah, there are a few more. We are there? Are they interesting? Does Win App was boring? So is the no, no. I, yeah, I'm, I'm jacket, skipping some. Trying the to the weather jacket. The weather. You know, no, yeah, some. Schwack it. What is it called? Schwack it. That's what it was called. <laughs> I just guessed. No, uh, there's another one for uh, mu- uh, trailers on a uh, uh, movie trailers. Movie I wanted trailers that for for Apple iPhone. Yes, and it's just it shows you new movie trailers that you go. So you could also buy tickets on it and. Um, Look at reviews and things like that. So I tried download on my iPod, which is like a 3G mm-hmm. iPod, um, and I don't have the like my software isn't good enough, so I couldn't download it. Womp womp. <laughs> and and hold on, let me scroll down here. Yeah, it's just there's just a couple more. There's a just say one more, please. Pick well, yeah. your favorite and pick one. That's all. I'm just picking one more. Power AMP music player for the Android. It's uh, Power AMP is old. Again, like I said, it could have just picked up in popularity. Not everyone would be as updated as you. That's why we're here, Matt and Tech Show, KSSU <laughs> How would you plug our show? What? In the middle of your story. I just did. I'm that good. I'm gonna cancel. I'm. St- I'm. I'm doing executive order, stopping your story. All right. All right. All right. Good story though. Those are some apps you can download and buy or whatever, or not. You don't have to. You don't have to. We're not forcing you. Mad Tech Show. Um, one more song. This song was requested by my brother because today is November first. His birthday. You all right? Yes. What was that face? Was you don't like birthdays? No. Like you don't like Halloween? something else. Anyways, um, yeah. So he should be listening um, right now. 
Should with his be. with his girlfriend who he's in London with. London. Um, you why? It's just the. Come on. It's London. You're. It's have you? Uh, you, I'm you, gonna don't take th- you don't think you don't think they do the same thing there. when they say you American? No, they don't. Okay. Well, they 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 they, they make when fun someone of says Australia. America in London, they don't go America with an American accent. No, they usually do. They usually do the Southern one. America. America. Anyways, this song was um, called Samsara <gasps> by the Mandala Virus, which he was the drummer of on this track. So um, enjoy this. We'll go at a commercial break and we'll come back with some more fun stuff. Fantastic. 30 second warning I'm there, sorry, Matt. man. It's on Matt, a CD what player. was that song? By the way, guys, I did not mean to choose. I did not mean to play that song. You, you were playing from a CD, right? I was playing from a CD and I thought it was on track three, but that's. Um, not what I wanted. Anywho, Cheerleader. That was Cheerleader by St. Vincent. Um, <laughs> not a bad song, but it wasn't no, what I that wanted. No, was, that was awful. Tex hated it, but Tex doesn't really know. I know plenty of good um, music. Debatable. N- n- no. Debatable. Um, you got anything else you want to talk about? No. No? What are you pointing at? I'm pointing at you. Because I'm supposed to talk? Anyways, next song. That was our commercial break, by the way, before that. Uh, I hope you enjoyed that. I, no, that was music, but bef- <laughs> before that, <laughs> no, I well, I mean, no, I was pointing that out because it's kind of obvious that was a commercial break. Yeah, I'm letting them know that wasn't the song. Someone might sing that like that. I don't know. Oh, I get it. All right. Um, the next song I'm gonna play is from. Sorry, back up. Um, where was it? Sunday. I was working on my speech, and I'll my Google sister, change the world. I Google change the world. My sister was. Um, don't mind that noise. My sister was um, at my house for the first time in a couple of days because she doesn't live with us. And um, she said, Matt, come downstairs. I have a gift for you. And I was kind of confused because our birthday our birthday is next Wednesday. Um, so I assumed she would just wait. What do you... Anyways. And... Um, mm, gifts are always good. Gifts are always good. So I went downstairs she g- and... Um, she gave me this little Chinese box, you know, those Chinese takeout boxes. A panda? You no, it was just it, there was a gift in there, and um, she gave me a, a card. It had a bunch of crazy pictures of me. I, I, I guess I take odd pictures. Yes. Uh, <laughs> and she just compiled those all into one card that she made. It was cute, I guess. I guess. Um, and then she bought me actually concert tickets for a show that we're going to tonight. Um, f- Opening act will be KG Elephant, which is a decent band, really good, really, really different sound. We and playing um, any of them today? Huh? We playing them today? No, I'm playing the next band, which is the headliner, Foo Fighters. Um, no, never heard of them. No, I've heard of Foo okay. Fighters. I just, in my opinion, I don't. I mean, I'm a, not a huge fan, but I think they're one of the um, best true rock bands of our of this decade, I guess. Of our generation. Um, which isn't saying much. There's not much out there nowadays. That guy's tall. Um, but this song will be from the Foo Fighters, who I'll be singing tonight and enjoying and rocking out. Um, this song is slower. It's a uh, acoustic version, but I like this one as well. It's called Everlong. Um, Everlong. Yeah, Matt and Tech Show. KZJ.com. And we are back. That, that was, was Everlong, Everlong by the Foo Fighters, um, which I'll be singing them tonight. You are. What you, you are? You're going tonight. That's what I was saying. Yeah, I am going tonight. Good, good um, observation. Anyways, you might hear a weird noise. That's our show for this Tuesday evening. Next Tuesday, maybe show, maybe not. We'll see. Uh, most likely a show until I until I decide. Um, right. But yeah. Thanks for listening this week. I'll play one more song. Um, from the Prodigy, which is a electronica, some sort of band that I really enjoy, and I haven't actually played them on the show before. It's all instrumental, um, so don't be listening for lyrics. Um, once again, I'm gonna think, or not thank anyone, but uh, happy birthday to my brother, who's getting older and older every year, unlike Benjamin Button. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. I know. Um, yeah, so here's here's Breathe by the Prodigy. Um, like our Facebook page. Jenny, um, Tyler's girlfriend, 
Like our page. We need 100 likes. It'd be really cool. See you guys next week. KSU.com.